Hey gang, it is Andy from the Ask Andy Anything channel and Quora.com. And today I'm going to answer the question, how can you tell which iPhone giveaways are fake or real? And it is getting that time of year again with the holiday season fast arriving and desperate Gen Z's trying to win iPhone and other Apple giveaways on social media by liking, subscribing, and commenting on YouTube channels and or with Instagram influencers. Before we get into this video though, be sure to drop a like and a sub is always appreciated. And if you want to continue to get the best research videos on the internet, please ring a ding on that notification bell. All right, folks, get your wetsuit on as we are about to take a deep dive into one of the most asked about questions on the internet. And speaking of diving, we are starting this episode off with a YouTuber, Dallas Raleigh from the Man Plus River channel, who saw this comment on Quora.com from an anonymous poster who claimed that 99% of these iPhone giveaways are fake. Here's what the anonymous poster had to say. Now I'm going to tell you the hidden truth of the giveaways. My friend has a YouTube channel with almost more than 345,000 subscribers. He told me that 99% of YouTube giveaways are fake. Their main aim to boost their social media likes, followers, and subscribers on YouTube. Even he too admits that all of his giveaways are fake. His main aim is to achieve subscribers and likes as much as he can. Raleigh responded by saying, I'm sure there are a lot of YouTubers who lie about giveaways, but I don't think it's 99%. I'm a YouTuber with almost 100,000 subscribers, and all of my giveaways have been legitimate. I have never put video of me shipping the prizes simply because I feel most viewers aren't interested in seeing that. As a YouTuber, one of your goals is to keep your audience interested in watching the whole video and not skipping the boring parts. And going into a deeper dive, Eric Moran of the Eric Moran Film Channel just couldn't take it anymore and sunk his teeth into Instagram influencers promising iPhone giveaways and more. Here he is asking why a multi-billion dollar corporation would give a random influencer 100 iPhones. His explanation is rock solid, but if you want to see just how many leagues below the surface he goes, I will link his complete video in the description below. There are some Instagram stars who are promising MacBooks and iPhones. Yeah. And what makes this worse is that these iPhone and MacBook giveaways are, are fake. That they're, they're not real. OMG guys, Apple just hooked us up with 1,000 free iPhone X's. Follow us to enter. Why would a multi-billion dollar corporation like Apple give away iPhones for free to these random Instagram models who hardly have any following? Normally when companies agree to do giveaways with social media stars, there's normally something in it for them. It might be a smaller company that's looking to give stuff away so maybe it will promote their business sales. But with a company like Apple partnering with these Instagram models, it doesn't really make much sense. However, some of these Instagram iPhone giveaways are not done on purpose. As the British online news outlet The Sun reported back in 2018 with an article titled Sneaky Instagram Celeb Hoax That Steals Your Details. Apparently, hacked Instagram accounts belonging to TV personalities and YouTubers were being used to circulate this scam. It goes on to say that hacked celebrity Instagram accounts are being used to peddle an iPhone 10 scam offering 100 free handsets and Apple Watches. So a lot of times it's just really tough to tell. But a good rule of thumb to go by is the bigger the social media celebrity is, the less chance they're going to try and trick you into boosting their channel or Instagram page. Take for example, it's your boy, a Canadian YouTuber with 2.7 million subscribers who is constantly giving away free stuff as well as cash and he does it on video as well as through the mail. It is scenes like this from a young lady named Jayla who actually did win an iPhone giveaway from It's Your Boy earlier in the year that makes even more kids fall for the less famous YouTubers and Instagram scams. Why are wannabe YouTube stars so obsessive about getting your eyeballs on their channels? Well, the numbers don't lie, and here to briefly explain just how valuable your clicks are is John Corres, the owner of the YouTube Success System, a company that teaches people how to rapidly grow their YouTube channels. So CPMs are, in Latin, CPM means cost per milli, and milli means a thousand. So it's how much you get paid per 1,000 views on your ads that you put on your videos. This is my video here, right now it's at 6.7 million. But what this equated to was over $17,000, guys, okay? Now, that's $17,000 off just one video. So when you run across a YouTuber like Island, whose channel is almost exclusively built on iPhone giveaways, but lacks real quality content, the smaller YouTube channels are going to call him out as a click troll, which you will see later in this video. And as you can see here, Island has stacks and stacks of iPhone boxes, which are supposedly filled with iPhones 
which he claimed were given to him by Apple. I wanted to find out from a professional cell phone reviewer how often he gets phones for free. Here is what T from Technically T had to say when asked that same question on the YouTube Creators Hub podcast episode number 225. Please take a listen. Some, I'm fortunate enough to get a few phones. You know, Google sends me phones, LG sends one here and there, and a few other little brands that may send me their phones. But when it comes to the major Samsung and iPhones, that's just me straight up saving and knowing what devices are coming down the line. So the probability of Island even having one new phone out of all those boxes is pretty low. And in this clip, Dinky from the Dinky the Sync channel did some more deep investigative work on the legitimacy of the alleged Island iPhone giveaways. Hey guys, what's up? Uh, I'm gonna make this video very quick as to not waste your time like the channel we're talking about today tends to do. The one of the bottom rules in his giveaways is that um, my sponsor will contact you and it will be sent by mail. My sponsor will contact you. First of all, who's the sponsor? Second of all, how are they contacting you? No sponsor in their right mind would send someone iPhones to give away and request not to be named. If anything, they'd be like, okay, 10 minutes of your video is talking about us. Sponsors don't work like that. They don't just give you free stuff just for the heck of it. They give you free stuff for advertisement, and there was no advertisement whatsoever. So clearly, the iPhones in the video are actually not even real because you can tell by his video quality, he's not recording on an iPhone 11. Zexio as well gets in on the I'm bash Island joking. action. If you make promises Next. like Island oh, to fluff your views and subs and comments, then these are the consequences seven. that you will face when anyone, anywhere, anytime can strike at you through the internet. When he threw the boxes on his bed, you can hear that they're empty. This is second place. This is second place. This is second place. I just... It is not always easy to tell who is legitimate and who isn't. For example, Mitchell Lim from Lemmy Boy Vlogs is also doing an iPhone giveaway. But his approach comes across as more caring and natural and as a genuine human being. You guys, you know what I'm saying, you guys support me and I appreciate that, you know what I'm saying, this is my appreciation, I'm giving back to you guys. Based on his almost 14 million views on his site, he can afford to give away one new iPhone. But the way he does it makes you feel like he's really going to give it to someone and not just use it as a prop to trick people. He says he's going to make a video on the winner and that the giveaway should be ending soon. So I will be checking back to see if he does as he says. But there are so many YouTubers and Instagram influencers promising free giveaways that those at the highest level have to go out of their way to prove that they are for real. ZHC, one of the most colorful YouTubers out there with 16.4 million subscribers, is as transparent as you can get on the internet. You see his operation, his team of helpers, and the people that he gives his custom pieces of artwork to. He is obviously a very talented artist that doesn't have to rely on giveaways to get a following. He does it because he can afford to, and it just makes him happy. And if you still find yourself unsure on which giveaways are real and which are fake, here is something I can tell you from my experience as a high-level athlete, coach, and sales trainer. It tends to be the biggest talkers that get the lowest results. So if you are the man or the woman, then you know it and don't need to blow your own horn. There will be plenty of people to do it for you. In short, if it sounds too good to be true, you know that it is. And as your parents have told you a thousand times, nothing in life comes for free. We are not trying to teach you to grow up as skeptics, but just do your research and see what is behind these giveaways. If you are going to like and subscribe to a YouTube channel, do it because you like the content or the message, not because you want to win a lottery that may or may not be real. So anyway, I love hearing from you, so please let me know in the comment section below which scam you would like me to investigate next. For the best research videos on the internet, subscribe to Ask Andy Anything, and don't forget to turn on your notifications so you don't miss a single video. Virtually yours, Andy.